91.1 The Globe, live from the Globe TV studios. My name is Mike Morell. I am thrilled to say that I am joined by the band Here Nor There. Thank you, gentlemen, for joining us this evening. Yeah, it's Thank our you. pleasure to be here. Excited. So you, uh, you all were with us this past December in, in this very lo- location that we're at right now in the uh, studios, but uh, there's been some changes in, uh, since then. You have a new album coming out that you recorded, and uh, you have a bit of a lineup change, a new member to your band as well. I want to talk about both of those. We're going to do that a little bit later. Right now, I want to introduce the band. So uh, Avery, you are the one of the guitarists and lead of vocalists. Do you want to introduce everybody in the band for us? Oh, sure. I would love to. So my name's Avery, um, and like you said, I play guitar and am the main uh, vocalist and do a lot of the writing in the band. To my left here, we have Cody on bass. Howdy. He also provides a lot of those stellar backup harmonies. Uh, behind me, we have Dale on the drums. Here we have our newest member. We have Gavin on guitar. Hello there. And okay. we have another veteran from here nor there, Rick on the keys. Hello. Outstanding. So we got we got quite the show. You're going to play a couple songs for us. We're going to ask you some questions about this upcoming album, some of the lineup changes, some other things about the band. But uh, why don't we get uh, kick it off with the first song? Uh, what, are, what are you going to be playing for us first? Great. Yeah, we're going to start off with Curses on Your Masquerade. All right, Curses uh, on Your Masquerade by Here Nor There. Take it away. See you're holding out how your smile hides away. Lies that left me here to bed. Curses on your masquerade. A plague on both your houses, throwing our love away. All your lies be damned. Curses on your masquerade. Of your high class vase, your cheap charades, curses on your masquerade. Yeah. See, I found out what you're all about. I ain't gonna stay your slave. Consider this my exit. Curses on your masquerade.
See, I found out what you're all about. I ain't gonna stay your slave. Consider this my exit. Curses on your masquerade. Curses on your masquerade. Curses on your masquerade. Curses on Your Masquerade by Here Nor There, for, live from the Globe TV studios on 91.1 The Globe. Outstanding job, gentlemen. So Curses on Your Masquerade, a uh, little hint of Shakespeare there maybe. Uh, uh, can you talk a little bit about that song? What inspired that? Yeah, that's exactly right. Um, as I mentioned, it's a Shakespeare quote. I played Mercutio in a high school uh, adaptation of Romeo and Juliet. Uh, it was kind of cool, too. Our Spanish teacher at the time was directing and used Radiohead songs as some of the background music. <laughs> but uh, that line always stood out to me, and I was really into David Grisman at the time, and so that's kind of where some of those line ideas are coming from, and was excited to use that line in the song. That's outstanding. I, it's a, uh, actually caveats real well into another question I had. So when it comes to songwriting, I mean, you, you're a jam band. What exactly goes into writing a song for a jam band that... Um, I mean, it's some of your classic jam bands, your Grateful Dead, um, you know, different interpretations of different songs are theirs. I mean, live versions sound different from studio versions. How do, what goes into the writing process? Um, I think we d draw from a similar tradition. Um, as Neil Cassidy said one time, who's obviously associated with the Grateful Dead, we're working on a lot of levels here. And so in the same way, we like to pull from lots of different source material, be it Shakespeare or um, a lot of old literature and philosophy and also just experiences in our life. Fantastic. And uh, do you, each of you have a, a musician that you look up to most or like that you really want to, that you could say was your biggest inspiration for, I mean, each of you, if you, if you want to give an answer for that? Uh, a big one for me is definitely Fish and the Grateful Dead, and as well as jazz. I'm bi a big Miles Davis fan and others. Okay. Uh, fish for me as well, and then I pull from, uh, say, Modest Mouse, bands like that okay. as well. That's Cody, the bass player there. I am an avid fan of Jerry Garcia. I really love his work, and I really um, tend to emulate some of his stuff more okay. often than not. And that's Gavin, the newest member to the band here. Yep, He's a sure. Jerry Garcia fan. Okay. Oh. I'm the same deal back here, me and Cody, back at uh, Emo Kids at Heart, but anything you know, <laughs> classic from same deal, just the weird stuff, the stuff that's out there, the stuff you don't hear often. That's fantastic. I uh, typically try to draw from specifically Paige McConnell from Fish. Uh, <laughs> kind of in a phase right now where I'm trying to emulate him a little bit. Um, but, you know, in terms of uh, tradition, you know, I always like to pull some from classical music. That's I was raised and trained on that for, you know, 10 or so years. And so. as the keyboard player, that classical music is a great beginning for absolutely. you there, Rick. Yep, absolutely. So, um, Gavin, you're the newest member. Uh, yep. It's one of the changes that I was talking about earlier on in the, the program. So, uh, What's it been like uh, breaking in with the band? It's already got an out. They already have one album out, and you're jumping in. You guys are recording a second album, which we're going to talk about during the next break. Tell us about that. Um, it's been a wonderful experience. I've known these fellas for a number of years. We've all jammed together, and then finally, I built up the courage to say, "Hey, would you guys like another member?" And they were more than happy to oblige me. And it's just been a wonderful growing process. And I think as uh, musicians. We are all growing together and culminating into something that we're hoping can turn spectacular. That's outstanding. So you all have another song lined up to play here. Uh, what, what are you going to play for us next? That's exactly right. This next tune is called Your Fool. Your Fool. Okay, here it is. Take it away. Bad can't get enough, honey. I can't get enough of you. There's an addict in the attic, jumping like a jackrabbit at the thought of the things you do. I just, I can't leave you alone. If only I had no one, why don't you make someone else your fool? Why don't you? 
if someone else your fool It was a time I called you honey Now I just call you untrue Here I am again dialed tone to my head Praying for a little more blues I just, I can't leave you alone If only I had no phone Why don't you Make someone else your fool Why don't you I'll tone to my head praying for a little more blues I just, I can't leave you alone If only I had no Why don't you Make someone else your fool Why don't you Make someone else Your Fool by Here Nor There, live from the Globe Studios on the campus of Goshen College on 91.1 The Globe. Gentlemen, that was fantastic. Um, I really saw a lot of interaction between the two guitar players. So I have to say, Gavin, your addition, it, it must have brought an element, uh, a different element to the band. Uh, the other, I'm kind of curious how that, uh, how you all feel about having that extra element with the guitar. Well, it, it definitely helps to fill in a lot of space. Um, me and Avery, actually, this fine young man over here taught me how to play guitar. So if you wow. hear any similarities, it's possibly because of that. So we have teacher and student in the same band uh, right here. That's fantastic. Yeah, we're still uh, we're still fighting for the top to see who's better, but I think I'm getting closer in on. <laughs> well, let's talk about your new album a little bit. Uh, y y it from what I understand, it's a little. It was the recording process was a little different from the first one. Your first album, Radio, came out in 2021, 
It was uh, self-produced, and from what I understand, it was recorded primarily in a garage. Is that correct? That's right, yeah. It was recorded in a garage where we did all of our rehearsing, and I was able to mix and master it and record it for us. And um, so that was a really neat experience, and we were really happy to have the chance to do it ourselves. We wanted to kind of recreate that a little bit with this uh, newer album. And so we did something similar, but slightly different. Okay, so what were some of those differences? I mean, did you move out of the garage? Did, uh, what, what exactly were the differences you're talking about here? Yeah, that's exactly right. We got out of the garage. We moved inside to the living room, right? Not okay. a very far <laughs> move for the second album. We would try to get a little bit uh, better sound in there, you know, do some dampening. And then um, in addition to that, we, um, I have a friend and a coworker who went to school for audio engineering. His name's Devin Carter, and he um, is just a swell guy, and he did all the mixing and mastering for us. Well, that's outstanding. So, um, and with this, well, you have a release date for your album, and it, it is, it's, it's called Westshire, if I'm, cor I'm correct on that. Yep, absolutely. And wh when is that being released? And that'll be released uh, not this Saturday, but next, and we are having a release party at Wedgwood Brewing Company in Middlebury. Okay, Middlebury. The 20... Eight. That's 26. So August 26, 26 is the release date. Yep. Well, you're going to play one more song for us, I understand. What, what song are you going to play next for us? Uh, that's exactly right. We're actually going to leave you guys with one of our earliest tunes. This is called Hive Mind, and I wrote this, gosh, way back in probably 2013. So oh, this yeah. is okay. an older one for us. So a 10-year-old song, Hive Mind, by Here Nor There. Take it away. What's happening? You're telling me that we're all listening. Said from the way I see it now, there ain't no difference. Nah, nah. To the one who hears, who gets heard, and the hearing. It all becomes one. Matter, space, and time. Becoming one. Speaking of sound mind. Becoming one once we get inside. Say hello, stay a while, and then hit your ride. They distinguish us nah, from the things I've seen. You know, there ain't no difference between us and them when we join in chorus. It all becomes one matter, space, and time. It all becoming one, speaking of hive mind. I'll be coming one, take some million kinds, say hello, stay a while, and then it's your eyes.
waste of time It all becomes one Speaking of sound mind It all becoming one now Takes a million kinds Say hello Stay a while And then we'll get your eyes Hive Mind by Here Nor There on 91.1 The Globe. We are coming to you live from The Globe TV studio here on the campus of Goshen College. Gentlemen, that was fantastic. And that's the oldest song that you have in your catalog. Uh, second oldest, just behind Daily Special. Okay, fantastic. Well, I really appreciate you guys coming and playing with us here. And uh, I really, really enjoyed it a lot. And I, why don't you let everybody know, like, uh, your social media. What, uh, where can people find you on social media? I mean, it's where a lot of bands reach out to fans these days. So uh, where, where can they find you? Um, sure. Cody, you're actually our social media guy. I'll let you take this one. Uh, Facebook and Instagram, and we have a YouTube channel as well. And I think that's it. Okay. Yes, well, so you can find us. Always message us on Facebook. We are also always giving out cards. Um, and we'll be on every streaming platform. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, so um, your new album, Westshire, coming out the 26th of August. And in Middlebury, what, what name the location again? One more time for everybody. Wedgwood. It's, it's Wedgwood. It's Wedgwood in Middlebury. Great little bar and grill, has great food, and uh, they've been treating us pretty well. And, and uh, if I'm not mistaken, they're making us our own brew. Oh, yes, that hasn't been told yet but it's oh. uh, you know maybe maybe well, it has been sort of now, <laughs> now like that'll happen. Well, we don't know when that'll be dropping but we do have uh, that in the works okay so, so wedgwood yeah. and middlebury the 26th of august here nor there their new album coming out westshire we're going to take it back into your regular programming now on 91.1 the globe my name is mike morell thanks for listening